ready today i have my october monthly plan with me uh, this is going up earlier than it should be because i was supposed to be having a halloween poundland haul going up today but i haven't been able to get any halloween stuff yet so i've swapped my videos around this is the kit i am using it's the october halloween kit from your world of color and then I also have all the extra bits I want to add as well as some leftover washi from my last plan with me. And then I do have some of my own washi as well. So I'm going to speed through placing all the kits down and then I shall get back to you. was off for the whole week so I decided to use a strip of washi left over from a kit that I've used so I use it to block off like the whole week and then I use this uh, poorly unicorn sticker to mark that uh, I have nothing down for the second so I just uh, fill the box up with washi. I use the ombre effect orange washi tape that I have and then my gold foiled Halloween washi to fill the rest of it in. Moving on to the third we had the council come out uh, first I placed down the rest of this black washi for marking my eldest being ill for the week and then to fill up some more of the third I use a thin orange washi and a thin gold washi just to fill up the box a bit more the sticker i use is a fox and cactus sticker uh, this came on a sampler sheet but um i think you can buy them as a full sheet 
came out with the Halloween collection, so I'm not quite sure if you can still get them. Moving on to the fourth, I did some Etsy ordering, so I used my gold foil Halloween washi and a Sprouted Paper Co. Etsy Sprouty. For the fifth, I ordered my youngest's main Christmas present. Well, I pre-ordered it, so I used some white spiderweb washi left over from a kit along with a Christmas emoti, um, emoti from the Coffee Monsters Co. For the sixth I decided to put my washi downwards in the box so I used the orange ombre and the gold uh, for this day, I came down with really bad toothache, so I thought I would use a headache emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. Just to mark that. I have nothing for the 7th, so I fill the box up with the gold foil Halloween washi and the orange ombre. For the 8th, uh, my youngest then come down with a cold just like my eldest did the week before. So to mark this I use some silver glitter wa washi and the orange ombre, then a sticker from the kit along with a black glitter heart from Ickle and Co just to mark this. I also then use the silver foil later on, uh, the silver glitter later on in the week, which I will tell you in a minute. For the ninth, I have nothing, so I use a full box from the kit. For the tenth, my youngest still wasn't feeling very well, so she had the rest of the week off. So I used the silver glitter washi like I did before, and the spider white spider web washi. And then a Coffee Monsters Co. Sick. Um, I have the rose stickers, so I use one of those. I'm marking that. For the 11th, my youngest had a dentist appointment. As well as an open evening at her chosen secondary school for next September. For the 12th, I don't have nothing, so I just fill the box up with washi again. For the 13th, I had a YouTube day, so I used the spiderweb washi again, along with a YouTube poppet from Laura Jane Style to mark that. Moving on to the 14th, 
I had a cleaning day. I used this leftover bottom washi from a kit and then a Le Petit Paula which I thought was perfect because she has a broom for the 15th I finalised the Christmas list for all the presents I need to buy the girls so I used some washi and then a Christmas list a moti this is one with a Christmas list for the 16th while I was out of town with my mum I had a phone call from my eldest school to say that she had fell down the stairs uh, she was okay but we did take her to A&E after school just to have her ankle double checked for the 17th, uh, my youngest wasn't well again. Um, she had a cold the week before and on the 17th it really got to her, her chest so she was off school again. So I just used the black washi and the ombre along with a My Friend Mochi Unicorn sticker. For the 18th, I use some more washi and a saving emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. Because I'm going to start saving up money to buy the girls' presents. Um, moving on to today, so the rest of the stuff is stuff that is set in stone and we are definitely doing because obviously I've had to put this video up early I'll have to go with what we will be doing so today I don't really have anything on today apart from I am um, it is currently about half nine in the morning and I am doing this voiceover for the 20th which is tomorrow uh, my eldest has a bunch of homework that needs to be done by next Friday so she's going to get all of that done and I use a Coffee Monsters Co emoji with a pen for the 21st we don't have much on so we will just be having a relaxing day so I will use a Coffee Monsters Co with um, a moti with a blanket wrapped around it and a drink for the 22nd it's my youngest's parent evening so I use the ombre washi and the thin gold along with a graduation emoji. Um, I use the graduation emojis just to mark school things because I thought they would be perfect for that. For the 23rd I will be buying a load of Halloween decorations for the house so for that I use the web washi along with a flag from the kit and a pumpkin emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. For the 24th my youngest breaks up from school so I fill most of the box with the black spider web bottom washi I had left over along with a happy unicorn sticker from 15 from we don't have anything on for the 25th apart from my youngest being off school 
so I just fill that with a full box from the kit. Uh, for the 26th, my eldest breaks up and she's going to a party with her grandparents and my youngest is having a girly day with me. So I've used a 15 frill Happy Unicorn. Um, one of the munchkins from the Once More With Love foiled sheets and a paint your nails emoti from the Coffee Monsters Co. For the 27th we will be putting up the Halloween decorations so I use some washi and some more of those stickers from the Once More With Love foiled sheet. For the 28th, I want to try and design some YouTube bits for my videos that will be going up through December. So I just use some washi and a leftover laptop sticker from a Harriet Wright Designs kit. Um, I have nothing that we will be doing on the 29th. So I just fill the box up with orange ombre, washi tape and the gold foil Halloween tape. For the 30th we will be going to my mum's and we also have a dentist appointment in the afternoon. So um, for that I use a purple car sticker from Fluffy Marrow Designs. And then lastly for the 31st which is Halloween, uh, my girls don't like going trick or treating so uh, we're going to have a Halloween tea at home so for that I just fill the box up with washi tape and then use this um, munchkin sticker eating sweets which was from a once more with love freebie sheet uh, last year I think um, I'm gonna go off camera just to fill it in the boxes but for now I'm just going to stick some more of these foiled stickers from the coffee uh, from the once more with love foiled sheet and then I will this is my spread all finished as you can see in the sidebar I just used some deco pieces from once more with love's foiled sheets that were in the shop and this full box which was on a sampler last year and this box says this year's costume as my eldest is going out to a party with her nan and granddad on the 26th she is going to go dressed as Hermione from Harry Potter but that is this month's memory spread all finished I uh, hope you enjoyed this video uh, if you did please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next one and please do not forget to subscribe.